Hey everybody, and welcome to part 14 of Crash Bandicoot, the Insane Trilogy. Let's do the last level, Behaving. The final level. A special gem lies beyond a clever deception. So, once again, a hidden, like, like a, a hidden pathway through a, a, a wall that's, you know, not really there, but it looks like it's there, like camouflage. Like freaking uh, Looney Tunes stuff going on in here. After this, I believe we get to go to the last world of the game. Also, whoa, I clicked the wrong button there. So we get to do this right away. The first level didn't really get to emphasize the whole, um, like, underground part here. What? Why couldn't I? That was weird. Also, one jump and you're away from the bee. Oh, swarms of bees this time. Can I, like, destroy the beehive? No, like, why couldn't I just destroy the beehive? Wait, can I? No, I, sw I, I was just doing a test. Like, I swear in the uh, old game you could hit them, but maybe not. Maybe I'm thinking of something else. Okay, I have a bone to pick with those bees. Okay, guys, I swear I didn't just walk into that. What? Okay, this is freaking peeing me off now, man. Like, your slide goes way too slow. Whoa, frick. Thank you for my life back. Was it worth it? Probably not. Get out of here. Oh, so you have really big hitboxes when you're like that. Go figure, man. It's not even worth it anymore, because there's no no life in it anymore. Because lives don't respawn in boxes. Wampa fruit and er wampa fruit that me and the nitro, no jumping up please. Oh one of these guys. Okay, where does he go? Oh, he just goes in a really mad diamond. Mmm, <clears throat> the checkpoint was over there. I hate these levels with a passion. Also, I was sliding. You guys seen me sliding, right? Okay. Frick you. Come on, die already, thank you. Like, I am not a fan of this level in the slightest. Cut his angry face of death. No! You are not allowed to to get that close to me, you know? Oh, thank heavens. Well, that worked out better than I anticipated. Um, I died before he hit me, that was funny. Like, See, as long as you just keep spinning, you should be fine from the hammer guys while going into the ground. There we go. Oh yeah, this. These aren't actually nitro. If you notice, they don't actually bounce. And they're in the shape of a staircase, so yeah, that's kind of weird, don't you think? Moles. Ah, oh, god darn it. Well, we found the purple gem at least. Triple! Wait, was that like a more like a quintuplet kill? Quintuple? 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 I don't, I don't, I don't get it. 
I really, really don't, man. I really, really honestly don't. I don't get why, like, that one guy hits me sometimes and sometimes doesn't. See, that time he didn't hurt me. Also, is there, like, a checkpoint close by here? Because, yeah. Well, let's go up the secret pathway, at least. So weird looking at the moles. Oh yeah, perfect. Now, the only reason I'm here is to see if there are any boxes. More nitro, eh? Oh, there are some lives in here, though. Also... Lots of bullets. Oh, well, that's useless. I don't think there's anything down there except for the, uh... The lives, so I don't want to be down there anymore. See, you take so long in this game to go into, like, the, uh, underground part. It's crazy. Okay, I don't even know how I hit him, but I hit him. It's also got to be a nitro switch in this level. Wait, do they always go into diamond? Do they always go into diamond shape? I... Ah, how? Crash, how? I'm going to say how so much. How Mandel is going to come and kick my butt. Omenomenom. I think the bees stop once you get to that point. Now can we please not run into the darn Tiki man? Oh, thank you. Whew. Okay. That is going to be annoying. I know it already, man. Okay. Good slide there, Crash. Good slide. I don't know what he was doing, guys, but that's what he did. Oh, I get it. You can't actually slide when you do that. Okay. Ready to install Black Ops 3. I turned off updates for Black Ops. What do you want? I don't play it anymore. Oh, yeah, that's bullshit. Pardon the swear, but that was bullshit. Like, he literally shot it as soon as I jumped into him. Mmm, bees should not be allowed out before you even cross the beehive. Because that makes a complete and utter sense. Yeah, that, that freaking makes sense. To have them freaking spawning before you even get out. Okay, oh, hey, I'm gonna. Oh no, there's even more to this. Oh, thank you. Okay, we got a. Uh... Oh god, guys, I suck at Crash today. And of course, today is the day that I have to record a lot of these episodes. Actually, I don't even know how I managed to hit that. I really don't. So, is this bonus literally just freaking uh, Nitro? In like a few boxes here and there? Yeah, okay, there actually are boxes that aren't Nitro. Oh, I know there were a few before. Oh. There's going to be a big nitro switch in this level, I know it at this point. Hey, we're going to get another life. 
So we're not gonna be super poor on lives anymore. Ah, sucks to be you, buddy. I thought there was bees here. Oh god, we actually got 100%. Yes, we don't ever have to come back to behaving. Let's go. Oh, that was that was glorious. Absolutely glorious. We got the blue gem, we got the silver gem, and we got the crystal. With a little bit of editing, it won't be too bad. It's still 11 minutes. But here we go, all the goodies. Crystal. And then this clear gem. One man's trash. Cutscene. Crash. I have discovered that the opposition is being masterminded by Dr. Nitrous Brio, the inventor of the Evolvo Ray. Brio was responsible for our misunderstandings in the past. He forced me to assist him in his plot for world domination, and he's at it again. He will attempt to stand in our way. Be on your guard, Crash. Deliver the crystals to Engine. Deliver the crystals to Engine, eh? Dr. Engine. See, Nufi Bonga always says Engine, but the game clearly says Engine. Dodging keeps you safe, but makes it harder to aim. Then why do I have to do anything? I get to shoot fruit. Here, eat my fruit. Eat fruit. Wait, that makes no sense. It should have cut me in half, man. I don't get how it says harder to aim. Your aim is literally the exact same in this game. As, like... No matter what you're doing. No. Oh, it's starting to have electrical shocks on it, so it's becoming damaged. Oh, we should be on this side now. Ah, oh, how did I not get in there? Where he doesn't open his guns enough. Wait, I destroyed that one? Oh, I thought he was gonna do his attack. Wait, is it not damaged? Okay, I'm like. And you have to keep pressing square. There we go. He's almost halfway defeated. Okay, the missiles. You can see the reticles on the uh, ground. Here we go! Fire in the freaking Wumpa Fruit Hole! Dude, can you like hold still long enough for me to actually damage you? This boss fight is long and kind of just drawn out. It's not difficult. This is.
Your best bet is to get him while he's shooting, though. Oh, one's about to blow up. Oh, and two, actually, apparently. There goes one. Thank you, that took forever, but... I believe now his attack pattern is different. Yeah, see? Now he, like, shoots missiles at you. There we go. And I now believe it's his core. I think it's his core. Wait, what? Oh man, we gotta do all this over again. I feel like the second phase is easier. And to hit him as well, like, I mean everything about it's easier. Alright, we're gonna have his attack. Oh, we almost destroyed that one. Ah, your arm blew off. Is he gonna do his attack on this side now? Nope. Not yet. Oh wait, no, it's this side. I almost had his weapon wrong. I don't know how I managed to think that. Oh, we weakened it. I get kind of like how, like, I guess the fruit juices would kind of like malfunction with the system. You know, aid in the malfunctioning. See, this one you never really get a, a good opportunity to just keep blowing it up. There we go. Now we got his darn shoulders. Come on, biatch. Well, we got some good damage off. Dude. Dude! Please! Let me damage you some more. Oh, we got some good hits off. Number one's about to go down. Like, I swear number two is so hard to hit. There we go. Now it's weakening. There we go. One is down. Like, you can't hit it when he goes over to the side like that. Haha. -ha. Now, I don't understand how we're supposed to hit him here. Hey, what are you doing over there? Man, this is just weird. Wait, you only have to get him like once? That's weird. Mech wrecked. I think Cortex will be ang angry that we kind of uh, blew up engine there, you know? Yeah, he's not going to be happy with us. Not at all. We kind of blew up his right hand man. Cutscene? Oh, okay. No cutscene. So anyways, in the next episode, we're going to the next world, guys. See you then.